weekly creative update. Do, 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 do. So this is Christmas. Hello, 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 and welcome, welcome to the show. It is Sunday, but it is not any Sunday. It's actually Christmas! We are here, we are here. It's Christmas, I am here, and you are there. That's really nice, that's really nice to to have you all here. But I can just say, I need to start with one thing. It's to say thank you, thank you, and uh, one more, one more thank you for the new subscribers. You're all so welcome to the channel, to the show, to the community. I'm so glad to have you here. Uh, and follow, uh, following me here on the channel, following along my journey. Uh, and for you who don't know, my name is Carl and I'm an artist. And here on the channel, I uh, I document my process. What it is like to be being an artist and, and the projects of what I do. Mostly I have this show, Weekly Creative Update, the view tuned into now special Christmas edition of course uh, so welcome to everyone who is here and uh, I wanna I wanna say uh, that I have a look here I have a, a silly little hat look here at the the comment that I got the, they got the, in the in the last uh, episode and uh, they suggested that I should should wear a, a silly little hat or something similar. So I have this hat now. It's actually my my own design, but uh, I haven't made it. Uh, I I designed it, and then my girlfriend made it for me. So that was really nice. So now I have the Christmas hat. It's a uh, green, red, and white. Uh, but it uh, was designed for this summer for our trip to Italy. Uh, but it also works well with the Christmas theme, with the red and the greens and the whites and everything coming into play. And of course, we're gonna eat some uh, some fruit here, Christmas fruit on uh, the show. But it's hard to to do it with one hand. Maybe I can can manage. Uh, we'll see uh, to to peel it off. But uh, let's get uh, let's get going. Let's get into the. To the real stuff. What has been going on in the week? I can feel this will be a long one, but uh, hopefully I can, I can do it. But we're here, every one of you who's joined in. We are family. We are together. We're here to share our experience and to learn from each other. That's what I want to achieve with this channel. I want to build a community. I want to. To, to get people to talk about what they're doing, what they're creating, and share the journey. It's uh, I think that's uh, it's important for uh, for an artist in the beginning of their journey to to just share everything. You need to learn, uh, and we can learn from each other. So hopefully, this could be a really really nice community we're building. We're do doing the slow slow growth, and uh, I'm really looking forward to it. But now I have to lower my voice. Because I'm going to show you what I have been making this week. And it's a Christmas present. It is a Christmas present for my girlfriend. Mentioned two times now in the, the show. I usually don't mention her. But now I've, I'm doing it because I made a present for her. Something we both need to her home. And she's sitting downstairs. But she's wearing sound cancelling headphones. So I hopefully she doesn't hear anything. That's what I'm hoping for, at least. So I'm actually going to show you what it is. And maybe I'm not going to say what it is. But it is this thing that I've uh, made. Um, and uh, uh, I'm going to show you some pictures of what it is here as well uh, uh, that I took earlier. Um, but uh, I made this in the workshop this week. Uh, it came out, uh, yeah, I think I like it pretty nice uh, here on both sides. It's... Um, it's this thing, a uh, little relief uh, going on. Um, so uh, here it goes. This is the Christmas uh, gift of 2023. Uh, really nice. And I, uh, you can see the color. I did it with beads. Beads. Colored it in with, uh, with some, uh, some red color from... Uh, do you say beads? 
red beets. I'm not sure, but you you get the point. So I'm trying and exploring and try that out. And I thought um, the color came off pretty nice actually. And then I put some put some oil on it as well. Uh, hopefully this can get used in the home for many many years to come. Uh, so that was one thing that I made this week. What I've more have I been doing? Let's see here. Oh, I've actually I've talked about uh, the project that I have, the co- upcoming project. It is uh, a, a public uh, public um, art piece here. One percent of the building budget goes to to public art pieces, and I've got a, a, a sketch proposal going on for it and I've got some help of some really really good people that I've been getting to know in the workshop where I am it's a, it's an artist couple and um, they have a lot of experience with this so I had a meeting with them this week and uh, received some really really beneficial uh, things there and got uh, got to see their presentations and how you put it up and how you you do the whole thing with with the public art and how you you work with it so that was really nice and getting to 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 more into how you do do stuff like that because I'm a, a total beginner I'm a total no newbie on that point but hopefully I can uh, I can get some uh, s- I've gotten some good information there but hopefully I can make uh, my own proposal and hopefully win the competition that is not I don't count with that I just uh, I just hope that I will uh, I'm just glad if I I'm I'm happy with it myself that's all, always the goal just to be happy about what you have created and what you have achieved and that is hand in on in the beginning of April, so I, I have a lot of stuff coming up. It's this sketch proposal. It's the um, the the show in Copenhagen, Sorbia Dreams. It's a sketch name for the show, but I've actually done it in Rhino. I don't know if I can show you here in uh, in Rhino the the sketch that I've made for the for the exhibition room. I've uh, planned it out this week, and I think I have pretty much every piece planned out that I'm gonna be having on the on the show. Now it's pretty much to to precise every piece and to to get get to work. So that is that is exciting. And then there's another exhibition in Lund, uh, Sweden, uh, at a little gallery there. And then it's another exhibition that I had a meeting with as well this week, uh, uh, just uh, a bit side of of Umeå or in the north of Sweden where I will have a show as well in the beginning of April as well. So so a lot of things going on, but it's fun. It's really nice uh, to to see that things are kicking. We're kicking, kicking and screaming, as you could say, in uh, here in the beginning of 2024. It's going to be it's going to be fun. It's going to be my first year where I where I will go go hardcore. We'll go really bananas crazy to do things uh, that I haven't done before. Uh, and it will. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I, I I thought of it. Not gonna do it this episode. This is a Christmas special. Uh, but next uh, next uh, week is actually gonna be New Year's Eve, and then we will do New Year's Eve special edition deluxe. And then hopefully we will get some things planned for next year's and put up some New Year's resolution and do fun stuff like that. But I've uh, written down one more thing here in the in post it uh, post it. Uh, post it uh, field notes kind of uh, uh, stuff here and um, that is that I want to make music I've been learning this program that is called Ableton Live to to make some songs for the the music maybe a little intro a little jingle uh, a little little uh, during I want to make more process videos for for the upcoming project just document it and can have some nice sounds running to it so that is something I want to dig deeper into making my own music for these videos and I think that that is pretty fun uh, I like them when without music as well uh, to just have them really show uh, to have this style of of just uh, just me working but some music can uh, that I made myself can really improve uh, improve the videos maybe we will see everything work as a sketch in this uh, in this YouTube series it's just uh, it's for fun and it's for the love of making stuff and just to show you what I'm doing this work is a sketch diary but enough with me talking here uh, you have a uh, Christmas Eve to get to I have a Christmas Eve to get to and uh, Let's go for the update. Let's go.
Okay, we are here and it is the update. Let's go, let's make it quick. Have I been creating every day? Yes, I have. I have been doing some small small tasks every day, working on mainly on the exhibition coming up, Sorby Dreams. So that's nice, little creations every day. Followers on Instagram, 1,374. Going up slowly but steady. And the goal is 2,000. Next one is subscribers on YouTube. This is a main. This is this has been an explosion. This has been crazy. What has been going on? The subscribers are your business just rolling in. The, the the goal the last week was 50 subscribers, and the goal was hard to get 100 subscribers during the six, six month period the, with the with the end of first on first of March. But I have 116, 116 followers. So the goal is we hit the goal. That is really, really nice. Thank you so much, everyone, for for uh, clicking the subscribe button. It is so much appreciated. I I love you all. Let's build. Let's build. Let's build this community strong. Next one: apply for competitions, scholarships, and grants, and so on. We are at. Uh, let's see here. I have to click. Fifty-five. Fifty-five is coming in. Out of hundred. So that is nice. Post on Instagram. 32. Uh, I'm doing it, posting two times a week. Go in and like the pictures. Follow me on Instagram as well. Uh, link is down uh, below, as you say. Uh, for next one, create this video. We see you videos, weekly creative update. Uh, once a week, I am now at 15 out of 25. So let's go. Be a part of exhibitions. Uh, still two out of five. Sell things, I am unfortunately I am at zero, but let's for fun say three thousand and seven hundred fifty right there. Release products, I'm actually been working on the on the video coming up here for my first product, so let's put one, uh, but barely one. I have uh, been painting it, and I, there there's some stuff uh, needs to be done, but uh, one for now. Uh, it's a bowl, and you've seen it before. I've sh I've shown you to early earlier videos. Let's get up closer. Let's get a little bit cozy, lovely up in here. It's getting hot because it's the last point. It's creative, weekly creative love letters. And we are at 18 out of 50. So uh, uh, some has been going out there. I've been getting some really good responses. People are getting happy and it's hearts left to right. And I think it's just fun to spread the love and to to uh, to keep the creative juices going and uh, send out the love to the people who deserves it it's really really nice and it's really inspiring for me to 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 see what other people are doing and following them and sharing their work it's really really nice uh, so uh, that was it for the update thank you so much and uh, yeah back to you carl thank you for that carl Thank you so much for the update. That was lovely to hear. Uh, I'm still sitting here. Uh, could do that while you had uh, the presentation, but I'm gonna do it really quick here because uh, I have a goal of eating the whole thing of this during this um, during this uh, video presentation. Uh, the Christmas episode, you have to eat something on, on camera on Christmas. That's going to be a tradition for this uh, weekly crea creative uh, update uh, Christmas special episode. You have to eat a mandarin uh, because they're good. The, it's the season for, for citrus fruits now. Uh, but as always, I will uh, go out on some, um, some positive quotes uh, that I always do. That was good, but now let's get to the point. Sorry for eating and talking at the same time. And my parents said that I was not allowed to do that, but this is my show and I am allowed to do anything that I want. And that's what's uh, so nice with having my own show and doing whatever I want. I can, uh, I don't have to listen to anyone. Did you see I took two pieces at once? Crazy, yeah, someone might say that. But let's see, some words of wisdom. Don't be afraid of failure. I embrace fail failure. I embrace it so much. I think it is so important that we put ourselves out there and, and, and getting ready to fail. You have to fail 
really, 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 really many times before you can succeed. Let's take me for ex an example. And now, um, as I said in the update, I've done like 55 applications. And I always receive no, 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 no. I fail like out of those 55, let's do a brief summary. I, I, I've got um, four yes, four yes out of 55. That's 49, f no, 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 no. There's 51 failures and uh, and four success it has it it is in those uh, it, it in in the that ratio you have to really you have you have to really accept that but you will fail 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 over and over again so i'm just going to say it embrace failure i embrace failure so much so much in my life i'm you have to do that you cannot be afraid because then you will get nowhere you will have to put yourself out there and be ready to to be unco uncomfortable, to be to 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 be weird, and to people will think of you as crazy. Some people will think of you as crazy. I probably think there's a lot of people thinking of me crazy with all of the stuff that I do. But you just have to to put yourself out there and do your work and believe in yourself. That is really really important. Self love. Self love to all of you out there. And um, in this Christmas time, I know things can be hard. Family things coming up to the surface. You're getting together and um, people are telling you some stuff that you maybe don't want to hear. People are being mean. They're being jealous of you pursuing your dreams. But don't let that get to you. Stick in there. Do your best. Do Always do your best. Keep keep the spirit up and uh, it's going to be an amazing year 2024 it's going to be the biggest year of my life i'm really looking forward to it i will have to start out this is for the after show this is for the afterlife no this is for the show this is for dessert later after lunch but thank you so much for me it's been uh, really nice to spend some time on you here on christmas eve and um, shout out to all of you followers who is there and I really wish you a merry, merry Christmas. And I'm signing out.